Hey, we live on location. Y'all have no idea how excited I am that I can finally share with you guys that I've got my hands on an early access version of 2K23 Mobile. You're probably going to be like, Books, how do you have the game already? Because it's going to be dropping next week, Tuesday on the 18th of October. A huge shout out to 2K, man. They hooked your boy up with an early access copy of the game so I can make content, you know, show it to you guys. And i like to take this moment to, you know, give a huge shout out to you guys. Thank every single one of you that support the videos, watch them. Because without y'all, I, I wouldn't be in this position, man. It's, it's insane. So yeah, shout out to everyone that's taken a second out of the day to watch the videos. Drop a like, comment, subscribe. Y'all are the real goats. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys 5v5 gameplay with the all-time Lakers against the all-time Celtics. Yes, there's now all-time teams in the game. We can finally use historic players, and I'm so hyped for this. And also, there is commentary in the game, guys. Finally, we've been asking for it for the last two years. 2K finally added it. It makes the whole atmosphere of the game enjoyable. It's, it's, it's lit, man. I know it's, it's a basic feature we've been asking for, but... It makes everything just way better. So yeah, I'm going to be using the all-time Lakers against the all-time Celtics. We, we went crazy with Kobe, man. It was it was really fun. And I'll be honest with you guys. Gameplay-wise, there's not a huge difference between 22 Mobile and 23 Mobile. The game does feel smoother, though. I'm not going to lie. For 22 Mobile, when I used to play, my phone used to get really hot. And the game used to, you know, slow down. It felt laggy. But this game, I didn't get a single frame drop. My phone, my device didn't heat up too much. So yeah, I was playing on ultra-high graphics. The max graphics you can play on. And it was extremely smooth, man. I also played on three minute quarters i didn't want the games to be too long let me know in the comment section down below what you guys want to see from this game what type of content do y'all want to see i'm definitely going to be uploading uh, some gameplay from the greatest mode the new mode in the game is really fire but hey i'm going to be leaving you guys with the gameplay so you can enjoy with the commentary and everything it's been your boy books see you guys in the next one stay with mark anthony and doris burke also joining us from the sidelines david aldridge We've got the Boston Celtics taking on the Los Angeles Lakers. Here we go. It'll be the Celtics off the tip. And now the opening lineup for Boston. We've got Russell. Bird is out there with Pierce. Then there's Havlicek. And it's Kuzi in at the one spot. Here's Kuzi. Havlicek left side. Shot clock at six. A shot, no good. And it's the Lakers the other way. And here's Bryant for three. Buries the long-range jumper. Bryant's got his team on the board to start the game for Los Angeles. Here's Kuzi. Knocked away. Oh, and here comes Johnson all alone. And the dunk by O'Neal. And how about the reach? Of O'Neal there, a huge target for his teammates on these alley oops. And it's the Celtics ball. It's a five point game. About one minute into the first quarter, passes it to Pierce. Three pointer, Bird. And Shaquille O'Neal pulls it down. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. Left side, Bryant. Count it. Good. Bryant's got five points so far. And I like to see this. Just five to shoot. Outside, Pierce. A three-pointer is right on target. Got himself on the board with three there. And that's his strongest trait. The, the unselfishness from Kuzi. Fantastic at realizing when one of his guys has an opportunity for a clean look. Pass to Johnson. Havlicek with it. Guarded now by Shaq. Pierce with a wide open look. Great play by Bird to set it up. Got his second bucket. This guy can do so much for you on the offensive end, and that is why his number gets called time and time again. Here's Shaq, and there's two points. Working on the glass, paying off that time. I mean, it takes a lot to knock O'Neal off balance. A, a massive player who just fins off the D with ease. Bird outside. Out left to the wing. Pass to Kuzi. Back to Bird. Over Johnson. 
and the shot is long. Well, certainly not the best defensive effort, but this guy can't make them pay for their laziness. And we reach the end of the first quarter. Lakers lead by four. Stay with us as we get set to bring you the second quarter right after this. And thanks again for tuning in. If you're just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. Lakers leading by four on the court right now for the Celtics. They've got Jones, Allen out there with Kevin McHale, and it's Cowings in at the five, roaming the paint. Just textbook basketball, right? James's IQ for the game so high, his vision and court awareness so good, he can exploit that pick and roll so effectively. Austin with the ball after the basket by the Lakers. Jones kicks to Allen. That three off the mark. LeBron against Allen. Here's LeBron. From the top of the key, he buries it. LeBron's got the lead up to eight now for the Lakers. Some tough offensive sets. They want to turn. McHale right side over James. Controls the rebound and puts it back up and in. I uh, love the determination he showed there, getting himself into good position under the glass. With the presence of mind to know just where the rebound was going to come down. Well timed. And they call the foul, so he's got the and one chance here to make it a three-point play. And there's a pattern starting to take shape here. They're working it inside and getting good shots from close range. Ryan is checked in for the Lakers. Celtics trail by nine. Outside, White. Jones for three. Elgin Baylor pulls it in. Kicks to Chamberlain. Ryan against Jones. Shot is good off the back rim and in. Ryan's got seven. And they're forcing the ball inside, and it's working like a charm. White looking around. And the pass to Garnett. Robert Paris has checked in for Boston. And we're about two minutes into the second quarter here. First shot, first basket. He's out of the blocks fast. How about the veteran Garnett? From the top of the key, and another basket for Boston. Probably wasn't the shot they were looking for, but they'll take the buck. Ryan against Jones. No good that time. And it's Boston the other way. Allen in the post. Baylor defending. White against Goodrich. Six to shoot. White drives in. An easy two points on the layup. And that's an example of playing big, adapting to the situation. Well, major height disadvantage. He recognizes that and still able to score. And happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. Los Angeles leading by seven. Shaq down low. Russell's there. Shaq can't hit. And for the Celtics. They've got Bird. He's out there with Russell. Pierce out there with Havlicek. And it's Kuzi in at the point. And guys, Havlicek in a nutshell. Just constant motion, unparalleled stamina. This guy will wear you out. Johnson, the pass to Bryant. Bryant is doubled. Los Angeles, they have shot just one free throw earlier. One for one in the game. And that one falls for Johnson. And Johnson drops them both. This is about the last guy you want to send to the stripe right now. They keep fouling him, and he keeps making them. Here's Kuzi. He's guarded by Johnson. And here's Bird from the arc. Drills the three-pointer. 
just such great consistency on that jump shot. Even though he's not always squared up, Bird terrific in the catch and shoot game. Basket good. I tell you what. He... Outside Pierce. Shot clock at five. From deep. And the Celtics hit again from deep. Wow, what a start. Three for three. Terrific play calling. Everything clicking out of the gates here. Tries from 16. And no good. Trying to use the glass. Celtics trail by three. Pavlicek dishes to Bird. Here's Kuzi. He's guarded by Johnson. And here's Bird from the arc. Hits the three-point bomb on the arc in the third for Boston. Outside Bryant. There's the triple. And right on through for another basket. He's got five made on five of nine shooting. Well, you can see it's a matter of pride out there for these guys. Absolutely. When someone makes a shot, the first thought is, I want my own back. And guys, there are two types of stars. Uh, I mean, the guy who makes himself look better, and then there's the guy who makes his teammate. To the paint. If there's a list of the best inside scorers in the NBA, Davis has got to be right at the top. When he gets his hands on the ball down low, you might as well just count it. And so it's Boston with it, following the basket by Anthony Davis. Rondo is guarded by Johnson. And out of bounds as the Lakers gain possession. Let's it go from the wing, and again it's the Lakers. And, and how about the lift? West gets on his shot, leaning back just a touch. Very difficult to contest. Rondo. And the last shot of the buzzer doesn't go in for him. And that's going to do it for the third quarter. Lakers lead by five. And time to step aside quickly, but we'll be back in no time. Celtics trail by five. Worthy out there with Anthony Davis. And it's Mike in and at the center position. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Worthy against Bird. Craps in the tray. Bird's got 11 points here in just the second half. Boy, they've been terrific from beyond here in the second. Passes to Davis. Over McHale. And Davis can't get it to go. Bird outside. And he comes up with the deuce. And that was the right call. Eat a basket. Go to the guys you trust the most. Well, you've got to earn trust and equity by making shots. Nice delivery there. And the Lakers call time here. This is reporting from the sideline. Hey, Kevin, during that last break, I heard the Lakers coach talk to his team. We told him, hey, this game is there for you, but we got to go get it. 50-50 balls getting to the basket. We have to give it all right now. Kevin? He's such a clutch shooter. This guy lives for these kinds of moments and delivers. Here's Kuzi. James covering Havlicek against Bryant. Floats one, and Havlicek with a nice basket inside. Havlicek's got the game tied up here for the Celtics. Right side, Bryant. Bryant is doubled. He feeds it to Davis. Lays it up and in off the pretty assist. Yeah, I love the tenacity. Terrific move at a crucial point in this game. That is not settling. That is going for a high percentage look at a critical time. Nicely done. LeBron with the ball. Oh, you watch LeBron. Not a prolific shot blocker, but when he wants to get it done, he is in fact. And no matter what they've tried, the beat just has not been able to deny them the ball inside. Kuzi passes it to Havlicek. Nice ball movement by Boston. 
Pass to Mateo. Six on the shot clock. Out to the right wing. The Celtics need to get a shot off. Three-pointer, Bird. That's tipped. And they force the shot clock violation. Great team. Austin making some changes. Russell comes in for Parrish. And Pierce subbed in for McKee. Bryant with it. Shoots over Bird. Again, Los Angeles. And that's just cold-blooded right there. He's taking no prisoners. Well, when it's closing time, he's trying to lock the door. He's been going all night. There's 45 seconds left in the fourth quarter. Havlicek outside. Bird right side, and it's in there. Has anybody ever personified excellence in all areas of play the way that Larry Bird does? But more importantly, he's got that clutch G. Two points here might be all the cushion they need. You would think so. This game is theirs for the take. And now they decide to foul intentionally. First free throw is good, and that puts them up by five. And he hits both free throws here. So now it's a six-point ball game. Well, you like when a guy calmly steps up, knocks down the free throws, exactly what you want. And looking for a very quick shot here. Well, Greg, you've got to run a play that's a quick strike. You've got to immediately foul after that. Now a timeout called by Boston. And Boston has possession. Three seconds separate the shot clock and game clock. And shot with the slam. O'Neal is a force of nature. Once he gets it that low, it is a foregone conclusion. I, I think it's safe to call this one a wrap. Well, it's been a hard-fought battle through much of the night. They just missed out on a couple of opportunities they'd love to do over. This one just all but in the books. Yeah, too many points, not enough time. Well, being aggressive and assertive, the big man snatching the rebound. Outside, Bryant. With the shot. Misses the shot. And so Los Angeles takes the win. A confident win and one where they clearly showed the greater effort. Yeah, I mean, it was a solid performance, uh, particularly here at home. Okay. Yeah. For Greg Anthony, Doris Burke, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. We'll see you later. And he's had the hot hand. What a connection he has to these fans. They love him here. And the more he has games like this, the deeper that connection gets.